where I just get to sit back, relax, and laugh at some stuff, but this week's episode definitely had a mixture of so much comedy, but also, if you weren't paying attention, you might miss out (coughs) on just how strong these people truly are, and I thought that was the coolest part of this week's episode, was just getting a real look into what Lloyd kind of had to deal with all the time, just being someone that's clearly not as strong as these people, but really just being someone who, uh, <laughs> who was just a kid, right? Like, he feels like one of the normal, normalest people when he's here, but when he's out of here, he's one of the most weirdest strong people that we know, so... It's these little funny instances that really give us our information about just how he's been living his life and clearly who's like the ridiculously strongest people around. And for some reason, the grandfather is just broken, right? Like, let's just get that out of the way. For some reason, he is just built different and we're going to have to accept that. (laughs) Because my man was like, oh yeah, wow, I haven't seen someone use that fighting stance in quite some time. Outside of our morning exercise routines, you know, so everything that girl has trained to pretty much learn is just an an exercise. Or like, it's something any villager (coughs) can wind up achieving just by really going and picking up a flyer and signing up for the class of exercise so yeah that's pretty disheartening to hear right like everything that you thought you were doing and that was you know powerful and strong to this village is just another day exercising pretty much (laughs) so take that as you will um the other thing that's really cool is just how much the villagers are kind of sizing up all these women for their for their boy, for their little chap. Because um, Lloyd definitely is in. Uh, uh, excuse me. Lloyd is definitely uh, not paying attention, right? Like you don't really care about that stuff clearly, and it's very very obvious when he's like. Oh, yeah, no, all these are just some of my friends from the academy, (laughs) which I'm surprised the girl didn't take that as more hurtful than just, um, you know, than what happens towards the latter of the episode, which makes sense for the girl with the belt to be disappointed, but all of them picking their favorite contestants to be Lloyd's girlfriend made it very obvious Whatever the girl with the belt got going on, they don't want Lloyd dealing with her. (laughs) So it's like, literally, you can't win, even if, even if you're trying to get on the good side of these people, they kind of already have some ideas in mind, right, like for who they want Lloyd to probably be with and who they think Lloyd would even care to uh, be with so it's funny to see the one person who's talking about marriage and talking about uh, you know being the perfect one and whatnot is pretty much the last one who's gonna maybe get a chance to even uh, try to date so that's just how it be sometimes you can't be all forward and sometimes the people that actually want it the most ends up getting it uh, last, you know, or even worse, so, that's just how that be, <laughs> but overall, man, I really do enjoy what we're getting with these characters, I am hoping we get to see quite a bit more, but overall, let me know what y'all are thinking about all this, do you like, uh, knowing how ridiculously powerful these villagers are, I mean, we saw 
a kid, mom, and their dad jumping from a two a two story floor at the bottom outside into their own window so they can just like find something they left inside the house. And then when they left, they left the window open. So of course the dad jumped up and closed both windows without touching the ground. <laughs> There's just there's just subtle things in the show that are amazing, and I think they're killing it every single week. And I'm definitely interested in seeing another season because please don't let this show end on one season. Please don't be one of those animes. But yeah, with that being said, everybody, I hope you have an amazing day, night, evening, whatever the case may be when you're watching this. I'm your boy, the Anime G, and I will definitely talk to you sooner than later. Peace.